this is your sign. This is your sign, guys. This video is about pushing somebody forward who is thinking about starting a YouTube channel. I know this isn't my normal content, but over the past week, at least five people have asked me about YouTube and making a channel and how, how is it, things like that, telling me they're hesitant or they don't want to do it or they're just any any reason why not to. And I'm telling you, you need to do it. If you have a bag, if you have, when I say you have a bag, if you have something that you love, that you are into, that you could just talk about every day for hours at nauseam, just to, just this makes you happy. Or if you're going through a certain experience that you feel was like just so enlightening, just talk about it, man. Make five videos, just record them, just sit in front of the camera. You ain't gotta do all this fancy editing like I thought you had to do in the beginning. Like all you really gotta do is just talk and tell your story and what happened. Even if you don't feel comfortable sharing every bit of it, just the, the premise, the setting, and what you did to get through it. The steps, I'm telling you, it's people that want to hear about it. Keep seeing these videos about this woman named Doe Dash. I'm telling you, she just blew up out of nowhere. I won't say out of nowhere because she's been making videos for a while, but it's like once you hit, once you hit an algorithm and it start taking off, like it could change your life. It could really change your life. The videos I make have been so therapeutic for me. I've taken a lot of them down. I took a lot of the videos down that I made in the beginning just because I'm in a different place now. And that's the beauty of it. Like, if you make videos in the beginning that you don't want out there anymore, you can just mark them as private or you can delete them. It's totally up to you. You don't need a fancy camera. You don't need one of these little fancy microphones. You can get one if you if you got it, or they got a lot of different options on Amazon for like under twenty bucks, ten bucks, man. I find you somewhere nice and sunny, or a nice lamp so your videos aren't all dark like mine are <laughs> when I shoot them at nighttime. But it don't take much, man. It just take you speaking and taking your time and telling your story. There's so many creators I, I look at now when they pop up on my feed and I see how much they've grown just to the sheer fact that they just didn't give up. They just kept making videos. There's some people that are overnight successes, overnight stars. But then there's people that I see, you know, that started years ago and now they here, they up. The videos are getting so many views and they're able to have all these different opportunities and experiences. If you're somebody who has time to create, if you don't have any kids, or even if you have kids, like all you need is about 30 minutes, man. I used to stress over not having the time to make the videos, but now like you see, I make some in the car. I make some at nighttime when I get home. I still want to do my, you know, production vlog style stuff. And I, and I got some stuff I'm working on. It's coming back. But it's more so just about starting, man. Just getting after it. It's about taking those steps, taking that action. I think a lot of time people want success. People want to be great. People want, want, want. But they don't do the first thing necessary a lot of times in achieving that want, and that's taking that first step. You have to get out of your comfort zone. That is one of the things keeping people from success. That's one thing that keeps people from breakthroughs is getting out of the, their own way. I am guilty of that. Should have been started my channel 2014. I should have started my channel back in 07, the first time I came to Atlanta, I made a video with my buddies a trip down. It was around the time Soldier Boy was <laughs> big on YouTube. I could have been an OG Soldier Boy, right? <laughs> That's crazy. But nah, man, 
be inspired by people like DoDash. I'm going to continue to make videos like this to push people towards just trying something new. If you don't, if you try it and you don't like it, it don't work. Hey, at least you gave it a shot, right? But nothing beats a failure but a try. Stop being scary. Be a dog. Get after it, man. I'm feeling good today. I went to the gym, lift a whole, whole, whole lot of weight. And at the end, when I was re racking the weights, <laughs> it was funny. This lady came over. She said, why, why are you being so rough with the weights? I said, what weights? She said, those right there. I said, they mine. <laughs> I can be rough with them. She said, no, they're not. They belong to the gym. I said, not right now, sweetheart. They with me. I don't know if she understood what type of mode I was in, but this morning, I'm telling you, I was in that mode. Still am. So get in your mode, get in that bag, whatever your bag is, create, man. It will bring value to your life. And yeah, do it for you if you don't do it for nobody else. All right, peace.